Five mini Strayer here. Playing some Black Ops 3. Um, this is kind of like a late start of recording. Like I joined in this late. My team is already up. Okay. What the heck just happened? So we're gonna be doing some snipping. Some uh, snipping in Black Ops 3. Like I said, I'm not that great of a sniper. So if I rage, I rage. If I don't, I don't. I don't know. Threat neutralized. I've been playing a lot of Rainbow Six, trying to get those new operators. The new Skull Rain DLC is actually coming out, so trying to rack up some money for those operators. One thing I have learned about sniping in this game, though, if you rush your shots, you're gonna do really bad. Like if you try to straight up quick scope, you shouldn't really do that. Like you should try to try to drag scope. You know, that's if I can hit something. I should have got that kill, but that was on me. We have to. Okay. Whatever. Are they really gonna try and spawn camp us? Okay. Whatever. I have rolling thunder, see if I can use it. Attack on request rolling thunder. Ambush that motherfucker. I got killed by my own rolling thunder. That's kind of stupid. That you, I don't even think you should be able to do that. Kill yourself with your own rolling thunder. It's kind of dumb. So they actually remade some of the Black Ops 2 weapons. So they remade the DSR-50, they remade the Peacekeeper DLC weapon from Black Ops 2. And y'all know Black Ops 2 is my absolute favorite Call of Duty of all time. Why can't, what is it about that one guy? I can never hit him. It, you know, you guys know Black Ops 2 is my favorite Call of Duty of all time. So, um... Yeah, I'm actually really excited about those weapons. I don't know what the odds are. Well, we all know the odds of me getting one of them. Stupid supply drops. Like, I would like it better if I could just flat out buy the things. Like, I know you'd have a lot of people that are just straight up just buying all the DLC weapons. And I feel like that would, like, kind of make it to where it's like, what's the point in, like, the DLC weapons wouldn't be as prestigious. But, I mean... Who cares? I want the freaking DSR-50. Are they really gonna spawn camp right now? Like, are they really gonna- is this really what they're gonna do? And of course, I get a hit marker. Great. You see me, don't mean you're gonna kill me. He did. He did. You gotta retreat, let your teammates handle gunfights like that. And I guess some, like, I guess some of, some sniping kills, it's, it's a lot harder to snipe in Battlefield than it is Call of Duty. So some sniping skills will just end up coming from Battlefield just because in Battlefield, you know, you, you have to headshot. So, like, I can get headshots in Call of Duty. Like, really? Like, my teammates didn't see him? Only thing about me is I just get frustrated eventually. Like eventually I just, I just I'm just like, bro, what's the point at this point? Like I don't even care anymore. Like I just get really frustrated, especially when I get a lot of hit markers. Like some some games I just get a crap ton of hit markers with the locust, and I just happen I just might not happen to have a SVG class. Like I actually don't have a SVG class right now. So if I do want to use SVG, I have to use the preset class. I actually I have a Drake in class and the Locust class right now. They're gonna be watching this spot. Reaper down. Probably gonna show up behind me. Yep, back 
Guy in the freaking white, I can't never hit him. Oh, they were set up for the collapse. Wait, what? See, that's what frustrated me. Like, anybody else see my crosshairs on his head? It's kind of like in Black Ops 3 when you're, it's kind of like you're shooting marshmallows at things, like. So one of them just rejected over here. He's dead. Well, round one. Do we win now? Do, do, do we win? Do we have to play another round? Yep, final kill cam. Well, that's all for today, guys. Peace out. Um, have a nice night. I don't know what to say. Scratch one.